everyone. Welcome to B News. I'm your host, Elisa. I'm sure you've all been watching American Idol, right? We love it because it really does prove that anything is possible. Season 10 has been full of shakeups, starting with the two new judges, Jennifer Lopez and Steven Tyler, and all the surprising eliminations. As the show winds down, the competition is getting tougher. The one question we all want to know is, who will be the next winner? I have my guesses. But while we wait for the finale, let's take a look back at three of our favorite ladies of American Idol and check out where they are today. Let's get started with the first American Idol ever, Kelly Clarkson. The original Idol winner whose success after the show is exactly what American Idol is all about. She sold over 20 million records around the world and landed eight singles in the top 10. Not bad. Kelly is amazing and a real superstar. Our second bad lady of Idol is season six winner Jordan Sparks, the youngest contestant yet to take the title. She was only 17 years old at the time. Her song No Air is the highest selling single by any American Idol contestant. In the years since she was on Idol, Jordan has stayed just a little busy. She's toured with Alicia Keys, the Jonas Brothers, and Britney Spears. Not to mention the many awards she's won for her music. She even performed on Broadway in the Tony Award winning musical, In the Heights. Totally impressive stuff if you ask me. Finally, on our short list of female idol winners is Carrie Underwood. Like all three of our picks, Carrie's story is about dreams coming true and hard work paying off. She has passed the 10 million mark in CD sales and has become the first country artist in history to achieve 10 number one singles from her first two albums. Her list of awards includes the industry's top honors. Plus, she just married cutie hockey player Mike Fisher, so things are going great on the personal front as well. B News recently went to the Build-A-Bear workshop in sunny California to chat with the very talented and always stylish Victoria Justice. We caught up with Victoria while she took a break from shooting her latest commercial for Build-A-Bear workshop. I started acting when I was around eight years old. Um, I grew up in Hollywood, Florida, so I was doing a lot of commercials, and my first audition ever was for Ovaltine, which is like a chocolate drink mix, and I actually ended up getting it, and I remember it being one of the most exciting moments of my entire life. <laughs> I would describe my personal style as being really comfortable. I wear things that, that make me feel good. I like wearing fun colors and layering and I, I kind of have an obsession with boots. I love boots and scarves and stuff like that, so fall is a good season for me. An actor that I would love to work with would probably be um, Robert De Niro, because he's a fantastic, talented man. What do I do in my spare time? Um, I like to hang out with my friends and hang out at home with my two dogs named Sammy and Sophie. They're Shanzas. And watch movies and um, go see improv shows and get sushi and go to great restaurants and stuff like that, ride my bike. My favorite summer vacation would have to be getting to go back to my hometown, Hollywood, Florida, um, because the beaches there are absolutely beautiful and the water is so warm and just getting to see all my family that lives there, it's, it's really great. Don't you just love her? Be sure to check out Victoria and thousands of others who are helping to spread smiles around the world at lovehugsmiles.com. Summer is just around the corner, and so are these bold, eye-catching colors. Think bright colors like orange, yellow, pink, and turquoise. Snag these hot star styles by adding a pop of color to your outfit and give it a fresh new look. We can't get enough of these vibrant hues, and they will definitely make you smile. That wraps up this episode of B News. See you next time right here on Bearville.com.